Hello friends! Alright, so I'm back with another craft review video for you. So exciting! I've actually had a couple of brands um, reach out to me that wanted to do little collabs. So I do have some crafts here to showcase to you and then I also have a couple more that are on the way too. So there's lots of different craft videos that I can do now. So this is with Colorful DIY. I will put everything in the description. Please go check out the description bar. It will be all of the links to the products. It will be um, the coupon code. Yes, they were kind enough to give me as well a coupon code. I believe it's Jenny Dash um, O F F. So Jenny Off. So you can get a little discount if you want to shop on their website to use that as well. And so this is another craft company that does cross stitch, a paint by number, lots of diamond painting, either full drill, meaning as in a full page, or special um, diamond painting drill, which is just a picture with just a few of the sparkly uh, drills that go on top, but the picture is, is there by itself in the background. So I was able to pick out five items, five. So I have five items to showcase to you. I will just do the, um, Let's do quickly the cross stitch as well. I kind of just picked out this really cute uh, kitchen cross stitch. I thought it was kind of adorable when I saw it. So that's just the photo of it. And yet yeah, you can see like all the little utensils and things for the, uh, for the kitchen. So to say kitchen, the kitchen sets <laughs> um, for the cross stitch. And I thought because my, so my kitchen is blue and pink so those are the colors that i have and it's like the pastel blue and pink and i found yeah so when you get your cross stitch you get all of your floss that comes with it but do you see that there's this um red color and peachy color i decided that like just on the pattern i would switch it out and anytime there's a little bit of red or peach i'm going to switch it out um, the red colors, <laughs> mind me, is going to be this pink color and then the peach will be like this light pink color because I have lots of embroidery floss. So yeah, so just kind of when I'm doing the little project. So this one is a stamped cross stitch. So meaning as in the pattern is stamped on the 8 cloth. I'll show you right here. This is my own embroidery hoop that I own and I just put the little this is the cloth I just put it into the embroidery hoop and you can see everything's already stamped on here and then you just follow along with some of the colors kind of come up close so I was working on this this week and this one is some cross stitch that I already did you can kind of see a darker blue color here and then in the background here there's these little purple so I didn't finish it yet just I wanted to showcase it to you Yes, yeah, so like my my tapestry needle is still there and then see how this purple is here so that's the color in the key to go along with this blue which is everything is labeled like B yes yeah, so like that's the color that I'm working on now but you just follow along the pattern of the colors and then see there's a key here but it's also your pattern key you follow along with everything. So there's patterns here with like all the little numbers on everything. And then the key to know which embroidery floss, what color you're using is on the back here. And yeah, I know I think my camera is switched around so everything's kind of backwards, but yeah. So then that's the key to follow along to find out which color um, of, but yeah, so far that I just did the little cup. I thought it was cute. And this one, again, this would have been red, but I'm going to switch it out to pink because I said, I think that'll match my kitchen a little bit nicer. So yeah, so that is, so everything. So you cut your 80 cloth. This is my embroidery hoop, very inexpensive. You can buy an embroidery hoop on the website as well. Colorful DIY has lots of storage items for your diamond painting and lots of store and, and accessories for your cross stitch as well. And you get your little tapestry, you probably can see, tapestry needles, tapestry needles come along with your cross stitch and then all of the floss comes. And when I get items here on the cardboard for floss, 
I always switch them out, which I've already done, to these little plastic can, yeah, little plastic um, holders for embroidery floss, and then I always label what uh, color or what the what pattern I'm following along on the key is. So I've already done that while I was uh, doing some cross stitch this week. Yeah, so that yeah, and everything comes in there. So I'll just be working away. I'm not doing. I'm not going to be doing any crafts in this video. I'm just doing a showcase and just just showing you uh, what I got. So that was the cross stitch, and I wanted to just showcase to you one thing too. So it came. So it came in this bag, and then all the instructions and everything are on the back too. So that's really great because if you're new at doing cross stitch and you're just learning, all the instructions that you will need are on the back. And because this is the stamped, you will need to wash that out at the end of like you, so you do your whole project, but you don't want to have that coloring underneath all your stitches. So what you do, I think it just says after you finish the whole pattern, uh, you put it in water that's below 30 degrees Celsius and you just let it sit for three hours and then the pattern will just disappear. So that's good. So the, the color pattern doesn't stay in the background and also all the um, the lines, see, like all these lines and everything and like everything up here, everything will just disappear and then you can frame your, your cross stitch um, artwork sort of thing like that. So yeah, so that was the cross stitch. I'm really happy with that. And it's fun that it's a cute kitchen pattern. So with the coloring, I think that will match really nice as well. I got two uh, diamond painting tools because I kind of am starting to really enjoy doing. So I enjoy special drill. Um, I'll just show you. This is one of the Oh, isn't she cute? She's like a little like 70s like little girl. I love it. So this is a special drill. And so this was a really nice picture that I got. And what you do is you just pull back the film and this is all tacky. And then you just follow along with all of the, again, the letters or the numbers and you follow along with the key of which color drill, which this is what the package of drills look like. All these cute little sparkly and there's some different like see their specialty sizes and things like that. So that is what you um, put together for all of the little sections. But the pictures on the background and so you just kind of do like little little sections. So it's a, a little bit sparkly, but not the whole um, not the whole sheet is a uh, diamond painting, but that is available as well. So yeah, so this is special drill and that's the type of diamond painting I really enjoy. So I got two of these. So I got this one and this one I already started working. So this is like a little seventies girl and I love um, animation and anime and things like that. So like, I just got this cute like anime girl. I think she's really pretty. And so I only got about from here up completed. But if I pull back the film, you can kind of see that how sparkly and then look how big the little flower is. It won't focus, but the yeah, see like how there's specialty sizes, not just the little circles or squares that some um, full sheet diamond painting is. But I think that, yeah, I don't, not focusing, but you can see all of the top there, all the green and how pretty it is. And like already just started on her hair color, which is really pretty as you can see the, the sparkliness of the picture. So this will be really pretty. And I like really love to put this in my office craft room, which is where I am right now. So yeah, so I'm in the process of working on both of these cute <laughs> special a uh, special drill um, diamond paintings, which I love as well. So it's great. So I got the cross stitch. I got this really cool um, like anime, uh, anime picture. Oh, that's what I'm trying to say. And this really cute like 70s uh, picture little girl. I just thought she would look so adorable as well in my craft room. So like when I've got these done, I'll frame them. So two little... Um, tools that I picked up as well because they have lots of tools. I said they have lots of storage items um, for oh and actually 
well, I was working, I forgot to say, when I was working on this, I was kind of being in, um, inventive, I guess. I just had a chocolate bunny container and I was like, well, why don't I just put all the drills in there? Yeah, see like how all of the drills went into like the little holes for my chocolate container. <laughs> Oh, whatever just go on colorful DIY and you can pick up lots of storage but I just thought hey why not just reuse and recycle some items I have around the house so I put all of the drills which you can see like how cute they are like the little drills and then I put all of the labels of what I would need to know what uh, what label it is so you can see these are those super cute rows I think they're adorable yeah so the big chunky rows for that uh, special drill painting. Yeah, so I just put everything in here, which I thought was kind of fun. But yeah, get your own storage items to put all your drills. And I picked up two, so I just picked up a new pen because along with your painting, you are going to get, so for both of those paintings, this is what comes in your kit. You get your wax. So this is a little wax that you have and you get your tray to put all the drills on and then you get the pen. So this is just like a simple um, diamond painting pen that you get. So this is what you, all comes in the package for you. But if you want to be fancy like me, because of course I'm always fancy, I went and got a specialty pen. Isn't it adorable? It's like, oh my goodness, like just look at it. So cool. It's pink and it has little rhinestones on the inside yet so it even has a little cover there you go so cover for the pen and along with this yeah this is adorable i'm so happy i picked this up i've been using this non-stop now because this is like i love it i really like as i said this is what comes in every package but you know you can have fun and you can buy little fun accessories for your diamond paintings and it comes with this little wax jar and each of these ones like pull them out so, oh, this one might be stuck. There we go. So there's one that I'm already using. So I stuck it in there and you have two more, <laughs> you have two more discs rounds so that when you are finished with that wax, you can put a new one in. So it comes with three. So yeah, I'm gonna get, it's going to last a while. So that is, oh, <laughs> that's the little wax um, amount that came with, the pen, which is super adorable. <laughs> I'll put all of the items down in the description. Please check it out. You can use my discount code if you want to go shopping. Okay, the next, I, I, <laughs> I had to buy this. So they sell makeup too. No, they don't. <laughs> this is a lipstick case and it is so adorable. Okay, so this is a lipstick case. It comes in all different colors too, so definitely go on their website and check it out. So let's pull it up. Yep, it's lipstick. It's gonna twist like lipstick. And it's like, oh, look at that gloss. I wanna put that on my lips right now. <gasps> it's wax. It's wax that you would take your pen. And like, you probably wouldn't put it that much because you just wanna do it at the bottom. But yet, you would put your wax on your pen from it and it's in the shape of a lipstick tube. It's adorable. It comes, I said, I think there's silver gold and I got the rose gold one. So different colors, but it twists just like a lipstick. So adorable. And it even has the cute cover. It has a crown on it because I just love all the things like this. And yeah, so then there's my new diamond pen um, tool as well. All right, so I hope you enjoy this video. Come back for more craft um, reviews and things like that. Please check out their lovely uh, brand, Colorful DIY. They have lovely items on their website. I looked at everything when I was trying to decide all the fun things I would like to try out. And yeah, I love the cross stitch. I think in the kitchen, that's gonna look really pretty. And I'm really looking forward to working on these fun two special drill um, diamond painting. I'm already started on this one and it's something I really enjoy doing. It's very calming, so I'm having a lot of fun doing diamond paintings. So yeah, I'm really happy that I was introduced to it.
right, so if you like these type of videos, please like and subscribe. I do a variety of things here on my channel. Uh, yeah, and I do like to showcase um, really nice brands that reach out to me and like want to cl collab. And I want to say thank you for anyone who wants to collab as well. Yeah, just hope everyone has a great rest of your week and weekend. And we'll talk to you soon. Bye now.